Hi there, everybody. Welcome back to the Newport County Career Mode. We are at the King Power Stadium, and we're being hosted by Leicester City, one of the one of the teams that started this game in the Premier League. So I don't think they're going to be a pushover. Uh, let's see what news have we got. Let's start with the league table. Let's do that. We are still three points ahead of the chasing pack. We've got to keep the pace going. Um, Leicester just sitting down there in seventh, just outside the promotion playoff places. Let's see, there's their lineup. What they got? Ooh, it's a 4-4-2 with the narrow diamond midfield. Haven't done so well against it, but I don't think it's caused us major problems. Um, here is our lineup. We have Ryan also back in goal. Not many changes to this lineup. Samosa's on the right side of defense. Oliveira and Kuyper's in the middle. Bandowski returns to the lineup after injury. He'll, he'll be left back. Leonard O'Kane are joined by Han Cook Young in midfield. The same front line of Van Buren, Ramon, and Ten Vord. On the bench, we have Hayworth, Fikete, Coots, O'Halloran, Chapman, Watt, and Alfonso. So let's see, what have we got to talk about? Well, this is happy bicentennial day. This is match 200 in the series. That's fairly good. We're doing well, staying strong. Oh, how about that for a ball? Puts across, looking to Van Buren. The keeper manages to punch. And Leonard just miscontrols it. He managed to get it out. And Fandowski's ball down the line to Ramon is too much. So yeah, match 200 going well. The channel is, you know, staying pretty steady at the moment. Not too many views, but you know, I'm not really doing it for the views at this point. It's it's fun to have the games out there. It keeps me going in the series. Normally by this point in the year, I'd have burnt out of FIFA and stopped playing. And I normally go back to it maybe around July when the new FIFA stuff starts coming out. But uh, things have been going well. So I've still been at it, which is great, and I still want to keep playing it, even though not best FIFA ever. That's my analysis of this one. It's pretty decent, but it's got plenty of bugs to wor work out. Okay, and in. Oh, that's a good ball to the cross. But Leonard's strong tackle makes them go back out. Across it goes, and Kuypers just gets to it to knock it behind. That'll do. Um, In-game news, Van Buren says he's happy to be playing so much. He's doing pretty well. He's scored a few goals. And I'm happy to keep playing if he keeps doing well. On the other side of the spectrum, Charlie Coote says he wants... Oh, are you serious? He, he doesn't want us to do that. Oh, it's an own goal from Ramon. I don't know what Alsup was doing. He could have, if he just one step back, he could have caught that. I don't know what Ramon's doing in the box. He's the one guy I don't want on the box in the box defending corners. Anyways, Charlie Coote said he wanted to play, but this is not a game that we want to uh, give up on. So I'm not really willing to um, you know throw some weaker players in just yet. Uh, Leonard come across to take the throw with his. Long throw abilities. Here's Bendowski. Back to Leonard. Oh, that's not good. Runs into a brick wall. Out to Bendowski. Tries to turn his man. Puts it across. It's not deep enough. And a lucky touch out. Leicester are controlling this game, although they're they're getting all, they're getting all really lucky a lot of the time. I mean. The goal was probably the luckiest one we've conceded so far. And again, you can't say that it wasn't be it wasn't entirely anyone's fault except for EA. Why would you put the smallest guy in the park marking your back post? Set pieces have not been strong for EA recently. Alright, so uh, what was that? Yeah, yeah I said Coots wants to play, but he's on the bench, so if we do well... Which we are currently not. We can throw him in. I'd hardly call that a legal tackle either. Just lunging in. 
It's going to be a tough game to get back into already from the beginning. A lot of the bounce is not going our way. A lot of the just, just little things that are making it harder to come back in. A good tackle from Vandowski, though. Uh, and the passing just won't go where I want it. Oh, one by ten board. Now here's a chance to break. In behind for Van Buren. We've got 3v2. Squares it to Ramon. And he rolls it into the net. There we go. Hitting on the break is the way we do it. Especially once you get into the higher leagues. And with such a good strike force. If we get the chance, we normally put it away. Well done by Van Buren just to square that. Keeper had no idea where Ramon was going to put it. Good finish. All right, back in it. Let's go forward and get in the lead. Leicester are a good team. They're not immediate promotion candidates like I mentioned earlier. But that doesn't mean we should scoff at their abilities. Oh, that's another misplaced pass. So poked over the top. Roman's got the pace. Oh, but Schlupp is actually a player that we were interested in for a while. Uh, at left, I think he's supposed to be a left back, but he has got a lot of pace as well. So at least I understand why we uh, lost that tackle or that race. Lester coming forward again. Leonard sticks a toe in, forces a throw. All the way back they go. He doesn't know where to go because I'm trying to cover everything. Laid off to Ramon. Oh, has he got the pace to get going? Ten boards with him. Oh, he's just muscled off. Again, not exactly the most legal of challenges. You've got to play the ball before you play the man like that. A lot of movement from Leicester coming forward. Yeah, that little cut. My defenders just don't react to it. Oh, what was that? A little ball into the box to nobody. And all the defenders are like, yep, covered. We'll run away from that. And Keeper included. Where was he going? Keeper had no right coming out. He gave that goal up you know, half the time. Half the blame is for also. I don't know where he was going. You can't defend those little cuts. Where was he going? And who... Samosa was too busy trying to jump over the keeper to make any useful defense on that. That was a, it was a good finish. It was a really low percentage shot, but of course they got it. And, the is and we go behind again. This is a difficult match to play. But they've proved that they can be broken down. If we find the right opening. We really can't find the right opening off uh, a kickoff. And Buren just flicks it back. Samosa looking to the back post. Ten boards up, but he can't win it. That's not who I want on that. Kane is it back out, but it's a weak pass. That's a 100% pass for the AI, just with their back to the play, just turn and hit it. But for me, it's maybe a 30% pass. Different rules are something that really bother me about, you know, games like this. Over the top. That's very well oh, again, we lost out to the pace of Schlupp. I really wish we could have got him. It was a... Uh, I think it was when his contract was out. And how does he come away with that? That makes no sense. In behind now. It's a lot of their passing has been a bit weak today. Just like that one, which wouldn't keep rolling. It slowed up before it got to him. Oh, so close to winning that one. He's just tripping over each other. Trying to get the ball f around faster, but of course they read that, and I can't play. I can't use the players I want to use. 
so many things that I just push in buttons and it's not doing what I expect it to do. This has probably been the worst FIFA for that, where the, the controls that you're pushing are different every time. It's hard to play the game you're trying to play when you can't be sure of what you want to do, what you're trying to do. There's no way to make a tackle without getting beaten horribly because your guys won't make a tackle that's controlled. I have no idea where my defense was on that. Everyone just stepped away and let that shot come in. It's going to take something special to get any kind of result here. That's a good header from Ten Vord. There we go. Switch the play. Bandofsky's got space. Ramon saying, hey, give me the ball, give me the ball. I'm going to make a run. And then caught in his heels when the ball actually comes. Everything I'm trying to do is either misread or uh, it's, it's either misread or it just doesn't do what I'm asking. I don't understand this free kick mentality of throwing multiple people in the same area. Bandowski's cross is blocked. We'll hit a corner. We don't have Simovic in the box. Oh, I wish we did. We've got Kuypers. Let's see if we can float the right kind of ball in for him. Looking at Van Buren. It's just flopped away by somebody. And moving out. Man, these guys have just the best control ever. It's like I'm playing against a team full of Messi's. First time shot. I'm glad he took that first time. It's supposed to might have covered, covered it if uh, he had tried to take a touch. I think he knew that, so the pressure to shoot was heavy, and he completely missed it. There we go. Just float that across. Oh, what kind of pass was that? It was supposed to be just a little tap down to Bendovsky. That's why I tap the button just a little bit. But it, do it does something different every time. You can never be sure of what you're getting. My guys go to tackle each other instead of just go next to the, the guy with the ball and take it because he's not too far ahead of him. And a cheeky stud left in by the... Oh, that could have gone anywhere. Alright, what can we do? Let me push forward a little bit more so we can have options up front. Kuypers manages to get it out. Ten Vord now, trying to come forward. He's got strength, so they shouldn't be moving him around as much as they are. Oh, that was not even close to what I was asking for. I went a hard low ball, right, right straight. And they're like, no, let's put it closer to them because we want them to win it and reduce the power on it so that it doesn't actually get anywhere close. The, the passing has never been this bad in a FIFA game, at least in terms of variation from what you actually should get. Why didn't you go for that? I want first time balls and that's the one thing it won't give me. Come on, still going. Race to Bandowski. He goes to ground and it's a foul, but fouls just don't happen for us. I don't understand that either. All my players are falling down at the slightest touch. And their guys, not a chance. Another weak pass. Van Buren barge in the back. He's come off with it, though. He needs some kind of support. The only one nearby is Leonard. There's three guys defending us. Where's everybody? We're on attacking formation. And I'll have the free kick. There's no advantage. You know that AI would have got a free kick there for the foul that was really late. Oliver gets a touch. 
Yeah, we need this. All right, we need some subs. What do we have? We need. What do we need? Hmm. We'll throw Delfonso up front because Tenvor's just n not getting on the end of any of these crosses. So we're going to have to go on the ground. We'll throw. Who's got less? Uh, actually, Young is more tired, so. Let's put Chapman out there. And I think we'll bring on Tony Watt in a minute if we don't get a goal. Unless they're making a change as well. Leonard, with a guy with like 80-some strength, just bouncing off the back of these little guys. You, you can't play a game when the stats of your players mean nothing. That was well over hit from what I was asking for. And, in goes the and it comes. Finally also wins something. I don't think he's managed to make a save all day. Ramon's used his pace to get around. Oh, it needs someone. Delfonso not making any attempt to turn. I'm like, alright, we made the turn. Sprint! And he just walks. It has been a scrappy kind of game. We're going to need to get more forward. Roman turns his man inside out. Puts it across. Nobody goes for it. There's just no attempt to go for it. Leonard comes off with the ball. Touches it in behind for O'Kane. We need someone in the box. Bendovsky has a lovely switch. Picks out Chapman. Why would you step behind two defenders? That's that's the AI I'm, I'm trying to deal with. O'Kane okay, beaten in the air by a guy half his size. Oliveira does enough, but of course it's not actually enough because the ball goes where it wants and it wants to go to Leicester today. He was offside, they're not wrong. And it goes. Oliveira gets a touch away. Ramon, if you can turn and go. In behind, Delfonso gets to it, oh, and it's just missed. That was a chance. That was the same kind of angle that they scored from. Let's make that last change for Tony Watt. I don't think we have time for it, though. Van Buren's been invisible, so it's going to have to be him that comes out. Ramon's at least making an attempt to come forward. All out, let's go get it. Time wasting from the back. Kane wins that one. Needs some kind of help. Please. That's not help. That's not that's the opposite of help. Let's just give the ball away. <sighs> There's nothing I can do. The ball will not go where I ask it to go, even though it's at my guy's feet and they've got all the time in the world to make any pass. I put in a tackle, get the ball. This floats straight through his foot. Bandowski wins it, clears it, but not enough stoppage time. And there's nothing we can say. There's nothing we can do to combat this kind of garbage AI. When the button I push gives me a completely different outcome than it's supposed to, you might as well play blindfolded. Nothing that I'm doing is anything close to what should be the outcome. I say pass left, they're dribbling right. I say clear the ball, they're gonna put in a tackle that's nowhere near. We made one good attempt on goal and put it away. They got two lucky chances and they both went in. We earned our goal, they didn't earn either. I mean, this is like a 2% chance of going in, even with the crap defending that, that happened. And of course they get it. Whenever there's a chance of, you know, a, a low percentage chance of anything going in, 
the AI will get it 100% of the time. It's not, a, it's not a level playing field, it's not a fair game. And that's the worst part. So now that we've, you know, ranted through all the highlights, and we're gonna get some menus, I don't... Yeah, you know the drill. We only managed two shots on target, that's, that's not us. The, the AI and the consistency in the play was so poor that we couldn't even get more than one shot on target. Two shots over the whole game. I think we might be missing Simovic to get on the end of a lot of those crosses. We'd put a lot of crosses in and we just couldn't find them. But then there's just, you know, those two-footed slide tackles. They don't win the ball, so they just use their arm. And that's okay. Handling is in the game, but it's not. There's an option for it, but it's never called. All right, that's, that's enough. We'll have to bounce back in the next match. And I will see you guys then.